Drifting past the shores. Drifting past the shores. Past the time. I can ask this last time. Drifting past the shores. Drifting past the shores. Drifting past the shores. Part of you is part of me. Yeah. Drifting past the shores or past me. Most of my time. Um, oh. Kia ora part two, crack up. Um, it's Moomoo here again, I'm in the beautiful Te Whanganui Atara on a sunny spring day, about five days away officially from spring. Um, I just did a whole take before that didn't record by mistake, which is frustrating. Yeah, so I went away to um, to the beautiful Noosa and mainly to create some space for myself to find um, a sense of um, give, 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 myself, give myself some space to recognise where I'm at at the moment and where I want to go. So yeah, I'm sitting on like I'm getting on the plane, and this like this feeling kind of came started going through me, and it was like I felt like there was always like spirits like, passing through me, all this like energy. I was been reading about like the Brazilian rainforest, and I was thinking, shit, fuck, so much destruction. Um, and then I had this kind of like moment. Where I was like, there's so many things. being created and being made now and then, and then there's always things just just all this destruction but at the same time there's all this creation and I was like kind of like whoa and I started crying and then um, kind of sitting on the plane kind of crying uh, lucky I had some there was a space between me and the next person so I didn't have to be too it wasn't too awkward but I had this like feeling like you know that the beings that were passing through me on their journey wherever they were going wanted me to give them love as they as they traveled and so then I had the sense of like peace come over me and, and I felt quite I quite felt quite relaxed and ended up like writing this play about um, this kind of like modern mud eye sort of set in Newtown and Wellington where I'm from and as I had this like beautiful experience of just like creation like creating that I created freedom then I sensed this kind of emotional um, pain, and then I was like, "How do I, how do I connect to that? Like, what, do I, what am I connecting to? By creating the space, now I've created a moment of creativity, which in turn will create this um, creative output for me to express um, how I feel about the world." So yeah, it was pretty good. And then I kind of landed and I kind of swam in the Pacific Ocean, but from another, from another, um, no, point, another land point. And felt that energy, felt the heat of that waters, sensed the life that was within that waters and the humans that have swum there and all the other beings that have been connected. You know, like, like below me there's, you know, below me in the water here. There's like all these beautiful life forms. You know, if you read like creation story, it's like above and below, width and length and height. Kind of flipped, flipping, flipping from one um, view to the other. So I might be, I might be, I might, the water might seem to be below me, gravitationally. But if I flipped it, then that would be above me. Or I'd be beneath it, beneath and above and over and under. And it's just, you know, the water sits upon Papa Tuanuku kind of just floating. It just buzzes me out, you know, to think that this huge mass of, of energy is so connected throughout every single being and one of us. And the more that we kind of live in this state of like fear around its destruction, the more we, we're not offering it that respect and that it deserves. 
because then it's process of healing itself because it's healing itself as we connect with it and if we disconnect ourselves so much from nature that we get into these places of um, trying to find identity within if we, if we search for identity of our, within ourselves from a world created from human mind rather than created from the environment we're from, if we forget to observe nature and we create this kind of like this kind of artificial view of who we are, then that's where that, I think that's where the loss occurs, that loss of knowing. Yeah, that just came to me. You know, I don't know, some of it feels, I think within that process of finding ourselves and then disassociating with each other and, and that com, com, a lot of combat, combativeness. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of worry about that, whether it's, you know, it's, it's harmful or not. I suppose that's my, I'm kind of lucky within this bubble of my life and the flow that I'm in. Sometimes I feel really disconnected and like I'm just like, fuck, what am I up to? And it's just that when I call on help, I think I find when I call on what I need and there's people there that I know and respect that know and respect me and, and I call on them, then I get, the kind of, I get the kind of support I need. And without that acknowledgement, or that kind of, it's like a loyalty or something, I don't know how to describe it. It's kind of this thing, okay, I'm gonna call on this person. I respect what they do. Um, they respect what I do. I res you know, this sort of like this thing and this, when I start this kind of like constant like searching or finding or wanting something, then I kind of get, I get really disenfranchised from myself. And that's where the pain comes from. It's like that kind of, ah oh, shit, I want this, I want this. But it's not the right, I'm not calling on the right things. I'm thinking that these things will help me become who I am, but they're not. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to play this uh, Puto Reno. And I'm going to sort of sit in this little zone I'm in and try and release some of this kind of tension that came. That wasn't there before in the first take, which now is now. So yeah, Tangaroa is <laughs> making some more movements. Ocean of Kiwa, where Maui, you know, paddled out with all his bros. You're like, what up? Let's go find some fish. Yeah.
thanks to everyone who like supports me and there's so many of you out there that just you know ring me up or send me a text on messenger or you know and watch these videos and like yeah well or move you need to make some more of these videos i'm like okay okay i'll make some more videos you know i think that's that connection that we that i try to make this connection i don't know i'm just like sitting here just talking you know and if you feel connected to this share this with others you know that that you know maybe feeling like they need to know need to know that we're all kind of feeling this this feeling this pain and that it's normal and that this pain is is there and there's so much love there too I and mean, there's just, you know and there's so many people just doing amazing incredible things and it doesn't matter what you're doing you know you know you know that you know in your truth that you you are doing great things that we are doing great things and that this planet is feeling that you know it's feeling that that we that we want that we're wanting and we're desiring for this um for this harm to to, to ease you know nobody wants to live in disease or be ill eased or they want to be we want to feel the ease and you know and i think that the more that um that we slow i think it's slowing down it's just what it is it's just like okay my name's move and this morning i woke up and i had all these things i needed to do and i was like yeah well yeah i've got so much people to go to work you know and i don't know I don't know. I mean, I'm, this has worked for me. This is how I do it. You know, people do it in different ways. And I think that's, I'm just, I'm just gonna have to sit with the fact that I love it. And I love you guys. Yeah, so this is a Porta Titi and you can hear a giant plane flying over. Kia ora. Kyora Tangarua Kyora Tera Kyora Tangarua Kyora Tahirimatia Kyora Kyora I see your face reflected in the waters I swim in. I feel your body hold me in your arms again. I feel your love holding my hand. I feel your spirit in the things you do for me. My heart is connected to the beating of this earth. My heart is connected to the beating of this earth. So let me sing with you. Oh, Aotearoa. One more time. Aotearoa. Aroha. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just like that, I just feel like super chill now. Honey, eh? oh, and thanks to like all the beautiful humans in like Brisbane who held space for me last week. 
um, to like Ren and Glenn and Amanda and all Amanda's beautiful humans that I met and James and that so you know and then all the people I hung up with yesterday and Nikita Rosie and all the people I'll see in tonight and mum and dad and my babies I'm also in Tahoe yeah their mamas and their papas yeah it's beautiful land that we're on send my love to the like how the Amazon sort of like the breath and the breath of our land all those like fighting fires and planting trees and cooking food and holding hands and cuddling and making love and being present and creating and living and, and just you know every just every single day just find like a moment of just pure presence and just sit with that pure presence and know that that's truth and that is real you know and write everything down if you got feel like you got too much in your head just write it all down and burn that shit write it all down and burn it and let it go you know try and let it go and yeah you'll find yourself I'm finding myself. Every every day I find myself again. And this every day is fresh and new and Yeah. So yeah. Peace, love and unity and all that goodness. <laughs> and I'll see you soon. Yeah. This portal TT is called uh, Karakia. And it was made with the beautiful um on the beautiful land at Matapihi in Tauranga. And it's part of an exhibition called um Mata Toa. Mumu returns. It's now one of my babies that I carry with me every day. Yeah. Love you all. Have a great day. Cheery. Gorgeous thing, I love the way you try to sing. I breathe and then I fly to you, cross the valleys close to you. Ah, some people say to sit within the valleys of the mind, the highs and lows we cannot find. I see my mona, I see the awa, I see the moana in my mind. Cause I'm free and I am, I am everything I need to be. These waves are like crashing over my camera. Ha! Shit. Ha! 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 Hey Manu, how you doing? What? What? Shit.